Hello, welcome back to another PCRC video. This one's one we shot the other day, just me and Billy, my little boy. Got myself with the Element Chevy that I'm sure you've seen in quite a few of my other videos. Um, the Jeep is Billy's FTX Outback Fury uh, with its new gold body shell, he's very proud of. Um, this is Padley Gorge in the Peak District in the UK. Um, it's one of my favourite places to go crawling or trailing in such a big variety of terrain for all sorts of abilities of truck um, you know from a from a really capable sort of 1.9 or even 2.2 rig you'll find something interesting but well, I think it's best for like a trail truck something a little bit scale looking um, but yeah it's, um, it's a really good place to go all weathers so long as you've got the right coat on it's uh, it's fine um, as I say there's a, a wide variety of terrain um, in the background there's quite a lot or there was quite a lot of the just all you can hear is the roar of the water if you saw in that first clip and see in the background of some of the other clips the river's quite high we went here following a few days of uh, rain and I think it is one of the big drain points off the hills up here in the Peak District. Um, so there's massive roar of water all the time. So I've decided to put some music in the background. Um, but yeah, it's just a little look at a little bit of the trail up here at Padley Gorge. If you carry on the route we take you, it takes you down to Grindleford Station. There's a lovely calf down there, if that's your sort of thing. Um, you could come back up the other side of the river uh, the terrain is a little bit more extreme on that side the way we've gone down it's a lovely rocky path down through the woods following the side of the river all the way um, the main path itself as I say it's passable with such as like a CCO CCO1 or a really scale rig um, but there's it's littered with rocks either side of the path and there's probably hundreds of different lines you could take at every every opportunity um, it's really close to where I've done one of my other videos at surprise of you um, you know, just just a field apart from where, where we parked we parked at the uh, Padley Gorge ice cream van if you're wondering how to get to it just put that into Google Maps and it'll show you where it is um, it can get very busy at the weekend especially if the weather's nice there um, alternatively you can park at Surprise View car park and walk across the field to um, Padley Gorge and follow the gorge down so in this video we go about probably about a third of the way in one direction then turn around and come back and got Billy with me the uh, five-year-old as I say um, just to get out of the house for a bit to be honest this was Saved yeah we had a nice time despite the weather um, hope you enjoy watching the video
So what you've seen so far is just um, sort of crossing the first few hundred yards of the field. There's a few rocks and some puddles that Billy wanted to play in. Um, you'll see in a minute, I'll turn the camera around in a few minutes and you'll see the, the river flowing down and forming the gorge over the big rocks. Um, it does get a bit dark in the, in the wooded area of the trail. Um, you probably noticed that on the camera as well. Um, but this is where it really sort of starts to drop down into the gorge. There's the river. There's down a big waterfall. It's, as you can probably tell, it's, it's quite high in that. Um, it's shot down the gorge there. Uh, this is the last little bit of the field before you enter the gorge itself. So we're in the uh, woodland section now. It's, uh, most of the trail is like this. Um, it's a popular place for walkers and uh, the odd mountain biker. It's quite hard going for the mountain bikes, I imagine that. But um, everyone's really friendly and interested in the trucks every time I go here. I stop and talk and you know, ask you various questions. I'm sure you all uh, experience that sort of thing. Just be respectful to people, don't you keep out of the way while they walk past. Um, yes, it, was a, it is a really lovely place. It can get really busy at weekends if the weather's nice. Um, but that's the only real downside to it. Uh, you can see here there's one little section here of rocks at the side of the main path. So there's, there's something for all sorts of capabilities of rig really. Um, or you can just stick to the trail and uh, yeah as I say it's possible with even like a CCO one um, something super scale there's even a little uh, creek section I think this is about as far as we went and then turned around and came back I say it's about a third of the way down the trail uh, another little creek, it's always crystal clear of the water um, until you drive your truck through it and stirs a bit of the silt up from the bottom. But nice little scale little section. Um, and I think this is us making our way back up from there. Just a few bits of onboard I got on the uh, cheap GoPro knockoff thing. <laughs> 